Ninth Story Studios, giving story a voice. The Christmas Toy by Angela Campbell The first time the Christmas toy moved, I assumed the cat had shifted the elf on a shelf while walking across the mantel. When I found it sitting on the sofa, I told myself I must have moved it and forgotten. The third time, well, that was different. I awoke hearing whispers, a softly mumbled, Merry Christmas. I opened my eyes, and there the doll was, facing me. The worst part was the eerie sensation of waking up and feeling a child creeping into the bed, tucking its cold body in behind me. You see, I was house-sitting. Aside from a cat and a dog, I was completely alone. Or was I? 